Welcome to Digital Asset News, the top stories in cryptocurrency digital assets and breaking down to bite-sized pieces. So today, we're not talking about the news. It's all about uh, the Cardano staking pool that we started all the way back uh, in December of 2020. And we need to do an update video just to talk about some different changes, uh, how we've actually become saturated in uh, DNews 1 and how to start to stake to DNews 2. So we're going to marry together uh, what we talked about in the uh, beginning in the first video and to some uh, different things as far as like the advancements of what's going on right now. So, of course, we're going to talk about uh, proof of work versus proof of stake as far as that uh, relates to Cardano. Uh, some reward expectations, what you're going to be expecting as far as like when you stake with the DNews stake pool. Uh, what is an epic? or an epoch. I know some people say, well, it's, 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 it's epic or it's epoch. Look, Charles Hoskinson says epic. I will say epic. And that is that. And then uh, we're going to talk about the difference between Cardano staking versus Ethereum 2.0 staking and why, in my humble opinion, I think Cardano really knocked it out of the park. It makes things, you know, a heck of a lot easier. And uh, then lastly, we'll follow up with how to use three different wallets to stake to the DNU stake pool. So we'll take a look at uh, the Daedalus wallet, Yolroy and ADA Lite. And I can show you just exactly how easy it is. But just to preface, uh, we had to make this video because the first uh, Cardano uh, staking pool for DNews is going to be at saturation point because they're going to reduce uh, the amounts that are available uh, into each staking pool from 63 million to 32 million. And then lastly, before we break in, this is the web page I'm uh, referencing when I talk about this in the video. This is over at banteachcrypto.com. You can find this specific page in a couple of different ways. First, if you're on YouTube, you can just uh, scroll in the description and down here it'll say Ban Cardano Stake Pool. And there'll be a link which will lead you right to that web page. Or you can always go to danteachescrypto.com. And then in the menu section, home, sign up about reviews, blog, contact, and then ABA staking. When you click on that, it'll take you right to this exact page. So without further ado, let's jump into the video. So let's break it down to the basics. A POW system or proof of work system is the kind that Bitcoin uses where a, a bunch of computers solve complex math problems and they get a reward, which is uh, more Bitcoin. Now Cardano is different. Cardano uses a proof of stake system, which is like a lottery and each ticket is one Cardano token. So the more tickets you have, the greater chance you have to win the lottery prize. And that prize is the opportunity to validate a block and add it to the Cardano blockchain. When you win this opportunity, you must be online at the exact time of winning or else this opportunity will go to the next Cardano holder and you could miss out on the chance to claim that reward. Or you could simply delegate to a stake pool like DNews, which is up and online 24 seven, 365. So there's never a chance you won't miss out on rewards. Now, as far as rewards, expect to receive approximately four to 6% annually, which really, I mean, it's pretty good for just delegating. Now, rewards are paid out every epic and a Cardano epic is every five days. Your initial delegation stake may take about two to three epics to receive rewards, which is like 10 to 15 days. But after that, expect your rewards every single epic. Now, to clarify this point, there is a nice little graphic that I like to use called a delegation cycle. And it really depends on when you start to delegate. So if it's at the very beginning of an epic at like, let's say 213, it will take you a while to start to receive those rewards. If you stake at the tail end of a particular epic, then it'll be a little bit shorter. So just so you know, that is exactly how these things work out. Now, delegating your Cardano does not put your ADA at risk as your Cardano stays in your wallet. Your Cardano is absolutely not locked up. You can unstake at any time and you're free to move. So there's no lockup time frame or anything of that kind of nonsense. Also, there's no minimum requirement to stake and you can add or remove your Cardano at any time for staking at the DNews uh, staking pool. Also, stake pools such as DNews are trustless, which means that we don't receive your rewards and then disperse them to you. Actually, what happens is a uh, Cardano protocol determines your rewards and pays out automatically directly to your wallet. Now, another great benefit of Cardano staking and choosing a stake pool such as DNews is that there are no slashing penalties. With Ethereum 2.0, you could get a slashing penalty or have part of your stake ETH reduced 
taken away or just simply burned for errors on the validator's part. And this could be intended or not intended. So this actually does not happen on the Cardano network. And this is why we're excited to be staking on it. Now, the worst that could happen is that she won't be rewarded for a block. But even that won't happen here at DNews as we have again 24-7, 365 monitoring by Grafana and Kubernetes through the Microsoft Azure, which is enterprise class, it's highly secure, and it's proven as one of the most reliable sources, which is why we picked it. Now, it's it's pretty expensive to run on it, but it's one of the ones or the best ones out there, and it's why we went in that direction. Now, there's two fees for the DNews stake pool. There's a 340 fixed fee, which is mandatory by the Cardano Foundation for all pool operators. This is automatically taxed from all the rewards that the pool collects. So this fee is spread out over the entire pool. Now, some other pools may charge more, but we charge the absolute bare minimum. The DNews stake pool margin fee is 5%. That means that if you make 180A, then the rate to the DNews pool is 580A. Now, some charge more and some charge less, and but with our platform, reliability, uptime, security, and competitive fees, I think we have a great choice for you to stake your Cardano. So let me break down these two fees in further detail. So if we're talking about the 340 fixed, that is between all of the delegates for the DNews stake pool. So that would be pretty expensive if it was just one person who had to pay the whole 340. But thankfully in our stake pool, we will have thousands of people and that 340 ADA fee will be dispersed among thousands. So uh, if we have 340 delegates, that means that each person will pay one ADA. If we have 680, that means that only pay uh, half an ADA and uh, on and on down the line. Now, as far as the 5% fee, let me break that down even further. So if you staked a thousand ADA uh, with the DNU stake pool, uh, that would mean that you would make between four 40 to 60 ADA per year, because that is the industry average between uh, four and 6% for the rewards. So these are your, your rewards, 40 to 60. So we are not charging 5% on what you stake, which would be 5% of a thousand. We are charging 5% uh, of your rewards. So that means that if you earn 40 to 60 ADA, so uh, somewhere around there, that means that uh, the staking or the fee ex would be only two to three ADA that you would have to pay. And that is essentially it. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how easy it is to stake with the DNews pool. I'm gonna use the Daedalus, Yoroi, and ADA Lite wallet. And this is our official website for the DNews staking pool. And real quick, let me just walk you through it. So uh, up top, let's click on home. Let's go to the very top. The very top of the page, of course, when you scroll over, got a nice little little effect there. This is everything about DNews, about what we just talked about. Owner pledge or my pledge is gonna be 75,000. Uh, transparency, and then you can check everything here as far as like ADA pools and just take a look at what the pool is actually doing, how well performing everything else. Uh, fees and reliability uh, on Microsoft Azure. Kubernetes with 99.9% uh, .9 uptime for max blocks minting. And then there's a little snippet here about uh, Cardano itself. This is a nice little video from uh, Charles where he goes into details about what Cardano is, why it's a third generation blockchain, what they plan to do and everything else in between. Pretty good, but it's kind of long, about an hour or so. You can, share, you can check the roadmap here, the cardano.org, IOHK, which is actually what they, the, the building part, and Emergo, which is the enterprise arm of Cardano. So just take a look at that. And then this is just a quote that I feel this is why I did do the things that I do. And it's because trust is a currency you can't buy. Uh, you've seen on this channel that when I talk about things, I try to be as, as precise and honest and open as I possibly can. And uh, that is, I think, why uh, you're here. Also with, with the website, danteachescrypto.com, just a regular website, that is 100% free. I don't charge anything for that. I want people to come in here and learn all about cryptocurrency digital assets. And this is just what uh, I feel should be done at this time. So then moving down, here's where we have the staking wallets, uh, Daedalus, Yoroi, and ADA Lite. And you can secure links here so there's no confusion as to where you can actually get them. These are the ones that I've tested out. These are the exact websites and places you can go to download these three wallets so there is uh, no scamming going on, which I always hate. So just check those out. And then moving forward down, uh, this is the exact same video we're talking about here, how to stake. Some FAQs, and then this is how we compare to other pools.
Now, in all honesty, uh, starting up a stake pool, I thought would be a lot easier, but it is a lot of work. And there's a lot of things going on, a lot of moving parts, and really it is its own entity. It's a, it is its own business. So if you're out there looking at pools and you don't see them kind of like treating this as a legit business, then be a little bit leery because over here, I can see exactly how much work it's going to be. And uh, again, it is a its own separate business. All right. So let's uh, go up here and let's show you how easy it is to stake with all three of the most common Cardano wallets out there. Uh, the Daedalus, Yodoi, and ADA Lite wallet. Now, just a quick note, uh, you can only stake your Cardano to the DNews pool with these wallets so you can't have your ada tokens sitting on an exchange and stake from there to our pool actually any pool it's not really how it works so again if you need to download a wallet just choose one of these three they're all solid choices the daedalus wallet uh, makes you download the entire cardano blockchain which takes a bit but the yoroi and ada light wallets do not so there's that's an option for you okay uh, let's start with the Daedalus wallet, and I'll show you exactly how easy it is to stake using this wallet. All right, great. So here we are in our Daedalus wallet. This is our demo wallet. So very easily on the left-hand side, you got your wallets, uh, ITN, and some settings. We're going to click on this little icon right here. Looks like a little square. And it's going to have Delegation Center, Stake Pools, Rewards, and Info. And of course, this is our Cardano, current Cardano Epic. Remember, those are every five days. Next Cardano Epic is another four days. So that is just what it is for right now. So, so what I want to do is go to Stake Pools. And I'm going to search for the Stake Pools. I'm just going to put in DNews. And there we are. Of course, we're not doing so hot right now because we are brand spanking new. So we're waiting for everybody to come on in. But uh, this will all change. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on DNews. Give us all the information. The official staking pool of digital asset news, power of Microsoft Azure. Same thing we just talked about, the rank, the pool margin, the pledge, and all that good stuff. So we're going to delegate to this pool. And this little guy's going to pop up, wallet selection, stake pool delegation, continue. So we're going to select a wallet. And remember, it's pretty much all or nothing. So you can have multiple wallets in Daedalus, uh, but whatever you choose will be, it's going to be the entire amount of what you delegate. So for this one, I'm going to delegate a whopping 21 ADA. I'm going to click continue. And it's going to say, do you want to do this? And of course, yes. So just so you know, these other pools right here, the one, two, three, four, five, these are the top pools that are there. But if you see that little bar right there, that green bar, that means that they're saturated. And when they're all the way full, that means that there is the limit of 63 million. Now, it used to be around 205 million for the Cardano uh, saturation point, but they reduced that to 63 million. And past that point, you get diminishing rewards. So I would not recommend to uh, sign up for any pool that is already saturated. We monitor all that. If we become saturated, we will let you know in advance and we will start up in another pool. And that day is today. It is February 19th and I am updating this video and we are almost at saturation point. If you take a look at the DNews 465, you'll notice that that bar is right in the middle. So if we take a look at pool.pm, which is a graphical interface to see what's going on with the DNews stake pool, you'll notice that uh, as of current, we have 32,684,798 ADA delegated to the DNews stake pool, which is the DNews one. And that is 50.8% saturation. So why am I bringing this to your attention right now? It is because at the end of March, the Cardano Foundation is going to reduce the maximum supply that you can have in any one stake pool to only 30 32 million. So instead of waiting for everybody to get to that point in March, we're being proactive and telling everybody to not stake to our first D new stake pool because we want to make sure that everybody has a chance to get the maximum rewards. And what will happen if you don't do that and we become oversaturated, things like this will happen where once the it uh, the ADA or, or ADA delegations become more than what is allowed, you start to have people lose rewards like it, what is happening right here with uh, with this stake pool. We do not want that to happen. So we're trying to be proactive uh, before these issues come about. So when you're going through the process of delegating to the DNews stake pool, make sure you look for the one with the least amount of delegates or that is uh, minimally saturated. Like in this example, it's DNews 523. And you see the bar is very low. And this is on the Daedalus wallet. When we get to the uh, Yoroi and ADA Lite, uh, you will see which ones they are because we will have it labeled as far as like uh, the DNews 2. And then you can see which ones are saturated and not. 
and that's what's best for everyone so that nobody loses any rewards. All right, so that takes care of that piece. Let's continue on with the video where I can show you how to sign up uh, for the Daedalus wallet to stake into the DNews. So we're gonna click on continue. And there's always a fee, of course, a little bit uh, 0 0.17. That's not for us. That's the Cardano fee. We're going to type our spending password. Again, do not give this out to anybody. This is your spending password, kind of like your private key. So I'm going to put this in. I'm going to stop the video. Click confirm. And voila, we are done. Stake from the wallet is now delegated to the news stake pool. And just like we talked about, sometimes it takes, you know, two epics or three epics to really start to get everything moving. And this is exactly what it says. In nine days, one hour and 40 minutes, that's when you can expect everything to really get moving. And that is as easy as it gets. So that's a Daedalus wallet. Let's move over to the Yorai wallet. So here we are on the Yorai wallet. This is my Yorai demo. I'm just going to click on that. And it's super simple. I'm going to go to the delegation list. I'm going to search by ID. I'm just going to put in the news and click search. And there it is. So I'm going to click on delegate. So now I'm going to delegate this wallet to DNews stake pool. So it's pretty much an all or nothing. It's either the total amount or no amount. And you can break up your wallets. You can create other wallets if you don't want to do the whole thing and do that that way. But for this one, to make it simple, it's going to about 19.8. There's fees for on the Cardano network, which is uh, already put in. I'm going to put in my spending password. Again, do not give this to anybody. And I'm going to click on delegate. Great, and it's already done. Successfully delegated. Track the status of the stake pool and the amount of time remaining to receive reward for the dashboard from the dashboard page. We're gonna click on dashboard page. And this is where for in the, in the Yoroi, you can check everything out. So that is it for Yoroi, pretty easy. Again, you can add as much as you want to, take it all out, unstake, whatever you wanna do. That's the beauty of the Cardano network. So here we are on the ADA Lite wallet. So up here, obviously I'm gonna click on staking. So one thing you'll notice is that the default stake pool is the ADA Lite stake pool. So if you want to get to DNews, all you have to do is, first of all, wipe this away. Don't need this. We need the stake pool ID. And to make this very simple, I actually put this right underneath the ADA wallet ID. We're just going to copy this. And then we're going to come over here to ADA Lite. And we're going to paste it. And then also, as we talked about, if we look over on the ADA Lite wallet, we see the DNews 1 ID and the DNews 2 ID. And of course, that is the one, the DNews 2 ID is the one that has the least amount of delegates. So there is no risk of oversaturation. So we ask you to use that second ID if you want to stake to the DNews stake pool. So now let's finish up delegating to the ADA Lite wallet. Getting pool info. D news, 5%, everything else there. So the fee, of course, is for Cardano. That is just one of those fees that they have. And we're going to simply click on delegate. So pool ID, digital asset news, D news, ticker, fixed cost, all the things we talked about, and confirm transaction. And it's going to sync the wallet. And then here we go. And don't be alarmed. The uh, delegate stake will always go back to the default ADA Lite. But if you see the staking rewards history on the left-hand side, you can see that the uh, pool is digital asset news. Also over on the right-hand side, current delegation, ticker D news, and everything else right there. And lastly, I want to mention this. If you go back to the website and go up to about D news, there's a link right here as far as transparency. When you click on this, this will show, go you to adapools.org and it will show you exactly how the pool is actually doing over time. So you can take a look at here as far as performance, blocks, rewards, delegators, and about. Of course, we are new uh, right now, so uh, we will definitely be growing and uh, this is the place to check all that out. Right. And now as an update, we've added a couple more pieces of information so you can stay up to date with what is actually going on with the DNews stake pool. So under transparency, we have DNews 1 and DNews 2. If you click on DNews 1, you can, that, and it'll take you to what is going on with DNews. And one thing I want you to, to pay attention to is the uh, return on ADA, which is monthly. And we are we are right now garnishing 5.47%. Again, pretty great considering that the industry average is 4 to 6%. And the return on ADA lifetime is 5.57. So again, doing our job, doing great things. If we go back and take a look at DNews tool, there's not really much going on right now because we just started this up about a week ago, but we've already have almost 6 million uh, as far as a live stake. And remember, uh, we can only take a maximum of 31 million. So on top of that, we also added in two more pieces of uh, information that you will need to know. The first one is the DNews 1 saturation level, where we can take a look at that, which is what we've seen before with the uh, pool.pm. And there is what is going on as far as 32 million uh, plus ADA and over 1,500 delegations. And if we go back, we can also take a look at the DNews 2 saturation level by clicking on that view 
uh, link right here. And we can see that, yes, we almost have, wow, almost 6 million and saturation is at 10%. So uh, these are two pieces of information you can use. And just by going to danteacherscrypto.com and then clicking on the uh, Cardano stake pool, or there is a, uh, a link in the description of all the videos that we do. All right, so that's it. I mean, super simple. Like I've shown a lot of people how to do it personally. Very simple process. I think Cardano uh, makes it super easy to do, much easier than Ethereum 2.0. That's just my opinion. And uh, there's just a couple of things. Just make sure that you know that if you're going to use a Daedalus wallet, just know that uh, it's the entire blockchain that you're going to have to download. So it takes a little bit more time. But me personally, I like the Daedalus wallet more. I feel it's it's the most I feel it's, it's, it's the most secure. It's the easiest to use. It's got the easiest interface. I know it's just there and it works. So that's the one that I'm going to use. You can use ADA Lite and Yoroi, you know, to download the whole thing. It's faster. Just I don't really like using them, but it's up to you. And then also two things, make sure that you write down your mnemonic phrase and keep it someplace safe. You don't want to be like me uh, who lost uh, 20,000 ADA because I had it in a piece of paper somewhere in some folder. I have no idea where it is now. Uh, so if you're going to write something down, write it someplace that you know where it is. I recommend a stone book. Links in the description. I've got two myself. I got all my passwords, all my mnemonic phrases, and I've got two of them uh, as a backup. And then lastly, just make sure that you have your spending password. So when you get all these rewards, you're able to do something with it. And uh, and that is it for uh, this video. So uh, hopefully you'll consider uh, staking with DNews uh, now to DNews 2 with a second staking pool. And uh, that is all. So thanks so much for watching. See you in the next one.